Tired. Yeah, right. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to the Archivet YouTube channel. This might be familiar, and he definitely should be familiar by now. This is my brother Dylan, if you don't know, and this is his new car. Today, we're going to be switching out headlights, and to do so, we got to pop off all of these little pins, which we've got most of them already, and they look just like this. So you pop off that top, and then the bottom will come out. And then you can remove this cover. It looks like we're still oh. hung up on something. Oh, hold on. Maybe there's... Just kidding. Gotta pull this out too. There you go. Just like so. Just pops up. Yep. So we're gonna hook them up with some super bright lights. And to do so, that's that's step one. And then shoot, you might even be able to get to it right here. Let's see. This thing should screw off. Make sure I grab the right lens. Oh, that's the bright. So we've determined that there's not really enough room to reach back there unless you have kid sized hands. Even my hands won't fit back there to unclip that. So what we've done is unbolted these bolts here, which were 10 millimeters. And then there's one up under here, right in there, that is also a 10 millimeter. Taking this out, and that was a quarter, I believe. Let me make sure. No. That is a 930 seconds actually. And then we got the star one, which I'm gonna try and leave that there and just pull this out. Cause I just need a little bit of room. I don't need a whole lot. So I'm gonna set you guys down right here on the cap and give this a little tug. Let's see. Nope, we're gonna have to take out some more, huh? But actually, we might not because with just that little extra room, I can now reach my hand under there. Yes. Well, except for oh yeah. <laughs> what in the heck? So the loosening of this bolt help out quite a bit. Yeah. It's hard to get to one. Yeah, because then I can still move that front piece out. <clears throat> Except I think I'm gonna have to take this one all the way out now. Because it looks like this light bulb is legit broken. Really? Yeah. Like the whole back piece is off, but the front is not, it won't come out. And I'm not about to try and just pry it off, so I'm gonna take it all the way out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep, so that's what we're gonna work on in here in a second. And this side we're coming along too. So, so uh, we'll tune back in here in like five minutes. Show them. 
Show them what we're working with here. Hold it straight. It's crooked. There you go. Yeah, All right. So we've got two screws. One here. One about right in there. And then we got a bolt up here that is a 930 seconds. And so we have to get all of these off. Instead of doing all the stuff up top, if you're just changing the bulb itself, you can go this route. If you gotta take the headlight assembly out itself, go ahead and follow the next steps. Okay, go ahead and click the recording. Well, there we go. We got we got one side done. Um, and here's here's a hint for you. You can do your bright right here. However, for your other one, you have to. It's back in here, and to get to it, we got to come through this little piece of plastic here, the inner fender cover. And you gotta pry it back and then reach up there hopefully you guys can see it where that little knob is that's similar i'm gonna try and point to it right there you twist that guy off and then your light will come out and you pull it apart and then you just go ahead and put your screws back in here the bolt up at the top and your job's done but if you do have to take out the whole assembly you're gonna have to take off the bumper and there's actually a couple more bolts in there that you got to take out and then you'll be able to pull this back because it's clipped in i can kind of show you right here if you guys heard that that's because it's clipped into the headlight and then you'll be able to pull this out with doing all of this so just so you guys know there you go now we're going to do the other side right quick and we'll give you guys a look when it's all done it looks pretty dang good there we go guys wrapped her up got some nice bright lights you got to check them out at night time however we won't be able to do that but my brother dylan definitely will he'll be able to see it and if you're curious yes this right here is a deuterra diffuser and what i have in it right now is peppermint lemon and lavender because i'm here to tell you guys that yesterday I was working a little bit at mom's and uh well uh, i need to breathe i need to breathe a little bit so i went ahead and i got my diffuser that is that i can move around it is battery operated from i got that from doTERRA which you guys know i'm an advocate for and i brought it outside and been using it out here and it's helping me clear out my throat clear out my nose making it so i can breathe again because we all know i need to breathe to be able to do cool stuff like this just like you need to be able to breathe to watch these videos so if this guy if this video helped you guys out smash that thumbs up don't forget click that red subscribe button and then ask three of your friends to also subscribe because we're on our way to 1000 subs and we're gonna get there in no time at all so have a great day ring that bell and God bless y'all. We'll see you tomorrow in another daily video. Yee <laughs>
keeps you connected to me, aware of all that I offer you. If you feel any deficiency, you need to refocus your attention on me. This is how you trust me in moments of your life. Amen. Man, I'm, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> yep. You'll find out real soon. Back to the video.